We're done for the day. Right, I was, uh, I was just sitting here. What happened to Sean? He still owns 70% of the company. All you had all day today was the salad. You want to give me something to eat? I can't. I'm not a bad guy. I know that. When there's emotional testimony, I assume 85% of it is exaggeration. The other 15%? Perjury. Creation myths need a devil. So what happens now? Sai and the others are having stake on University Ave. Then they'll come back up to the office and start working on a settlement agreement to propose to you. Wait, they're going to settle? Oh yeah. And you're gonna have to pay a little extra. Why? So they'll sign a non-disclosure agreement. They say one bad word about you in public and you own their wife and kids. I invented Facebook. I'm talking about a jury. I specialize in voir dire, jury selection, and what jurors see when they look at a defendant. Clothes, their hair, their speaking style, likability. Likability. I've been licensed to practice law for all of 20 months and I can convince a jury to believe that you planted the story of Eduardo and the chicken. Watch what else. <clears throat> Why weren't you at Sean's sorority party that night? Do you think I'm the one to call the police? Doesn't matter. But now that I've asked the question, they're all thinking about it. And you lost your jury within the first 10 minutes. <sighs> Four minutes. Yeah. I was drunk, angry, stupid. Blogging. And blog. Pay them. In the scheme of things, it's a speeding ticket. So I will tell you that tomorrow. You don't think anybody would mind if I stayed and used the computer for a minute? I can't see why that would be a problem. Thanks. I appreciate your help today. You're not an asshole, Mark. You're just trying so hard to be.